This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Valdemar back here with another episode of Metal Gear Acid. In the last episode, we finally made it to the bridge to cross it. However, some uh, nefarious some nefarious scheme went awry as uh, a Swallowtail or Talika, or however you want to call her, has uh, betrayed us, taken the Pythagoras data, and left. Is she the real Swallowtail, or is she someone in disguise? <clears throat> We won't know for sure, but let's get back to the let's get back to the end and uh what the Yeah nuts. Oh, of course it got blown up. Roger, the booth has been blown to pieces. Of course she probably prepared for that. What? Oh god. Now we're surrounded. Is this the captured character part of the game? Oh, not quite. Usually most Metal Gear games have a you get captured scene and you have to escape. Usually, but anyway. Roger. What is it? It's not good. I'm surrounded. You can't turn back, Snake. She's getting away. Hurry. Eliminate any soldiers in your way. That's an order. Yes, sir. Exterminate enemy soldiers. Oh, a mission where you actually have to kill everyone. All right. Well, I mean... You usually have to kill them anyway, but... Okay, so I can't do anything anyway because I use my turn to move, so... Luckily, I have all my combat cards ready to go, so... How many of them are there? Oh, right. Keep forgetting to press triangle. Four of them. Eh. Ow. And I just used my ration to move, too. Oh, this sucks. Aw, oh, goddammit, game. Okay. Yeah, that kind of blows. Uh -huh. I just used my ration to move. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's kind of crap. Why is my cost so high? Oh, well, at least I got a ration back now. Yeah, I had to be careful, because otherwise I'm gonna, all my cost is going to be me just... What's everyone's cost? Uh, really, them moving and shooting is like... A small cost. Wow. And this game doesn't really get me and put me in a good, per good, like, place for. Uh, like, it doesn't put me in a good spot for this either. It's a. Uh, I can't run away, obviously. When they know where I am, so like, there's really no spots for hiding either. Not really. I mean, I guess you could go into the blown up building, maybe. I'd be able to, like, back up in the corner, maybe, and reduce how many people come after me. Um, that might be the way to... Now, can I move... I can, oh, I can. That, we might have to do that just to survive. I didn't want to use a I didn't want to use an attack card, but uh, pretty much that's all that's all I have that's all I can do really. Hopefully they don't have to. Hmm. Okay, that's good. Oh, they're of course they're gonna go now. Are they actually gonna follow me or? Little, huh? Well, luckily for me, they're not going to. So that's that's good. Yeah, I had to use a combat card to get there, so... Now, uh, yeah, I'll wait. I'll hold on to that if, unless I use, like, a ton of cards, like, back-to-back. -back. Well, if they ever come towards this way, at least... try to go around. Now, God, they have a lot of damage, too. Where did all this, like, weaponry come from? Man. Hmm. Yeah, they must have new weapons or something like that that do, like, a ton of damage. I mean, luckily his life isn't that much, but... You know, maybe I will do use that 
that hard. Alright, let's see if we can finish him off. Okay, well, luckily his armor didn't activate. So, there we go there. Okay, good. Might just have to... We'll, we'll probably have to wait a few turns before we can... Uh, He's got a bit more life, so. Come on, come on, come on, oh. Ugh. I mean, come on, 75%, man. That's a pretty good percentage, you know. Uh oh, more guys are gonna come. Well, at least there's the. Did he have to reset his cards? Uh oh. Wait, huh? Why was there like a half-life thing in there? Oh, I'm I'm dead. What the hell, game? You didn't. There was no way I could win that. Oh. What the fuck? There was no way to win. The game basically said "fuck you." Now to do that all over again. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut to when we get back to that because that's that's stupid. All right, we're back. That took me about. Five minutes to get back there, so yeah. Anywho, okay, so all right, I'm starting off a little bit better this time. I'm gonna wait my turn though, even though I've got a, a movement range because I want to. I have a plan, especially if they're gonna do the. Okay, unless they're gonna ninja me, great. Um, but I've got a plan when they all bunch up again here pretty soon. Hopefully, they get pretty close together like they did. Like, oh, maybe not. Well. Ah, oh, come on, man. At least I got a heal, but still. Okay, I'll get to take out two of them or something like that. There's at least that. Um, eh, a couple of them are pretty close together. I don't have enough move to do that. I can take those two out. Okay, so what I'm going to do is since I have Mr. Gurligon here, let's go and use that. Not all of them, so it takes a while for them to move. Monster Beam! Or Zato Beam! Oh, wrong game. Ha <laughs> 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 I'm a badass freaking overlord! Yeah, I, I love the. I, I don't know if I love the game, but I like the character in that game. And then we're gonna use a grenade. Oh, yeah. Because they're gonna take a while for the. If, if we've got this right. Yeah, they've got a lot of costs, so. Yeah, finally time to use a grenade, and they can't move from it. You're gonna die, clown! Yeah, that's it. I want to go and heal. I definitely want to reduce my cost for sure, so we'll do that. Okay. And then the bomb should go off. Take out two of them. Yes! Booyah! They're dead. That's two guys gone. Too bad they do like a lot of damage, so that's the problem with this. Um, okay. Uh, oh, we got another big heal too if I need to, so definitely want to... Can I actually stack those moves? I, I think I can, actually. Oh, yeah, I can stack them, so... Alright. Uh, uh, what's their... What is their cost at? Mm. I don't want to... I can't use it there, because I'm not using that direction. I'm going to see if I can get a move next turn. I don't. I definitely don't want to waste my ration if I can help it. Just because of the damage they deal. Well, they can, okay, why were those one guys doing like 25 damage and then... Oh, well, whatever. <clears throat> Miss, come... Zero, why is it doing zero damage? I mean, the equip cards... I think I may have missed like... You know, uh, like, red equip cards. Um, because... And maybe it was because I kept moving like the uh, cards that gave weaker uh, like damage or something like that. But uh, let's see, that one could be used. Let's see, how does that work? Does it just move? I want to use it and see how this works. Okay, so I get to control it, right? Boom! Ah! That's awesome! 
And I assume you have to, if you get shot, it probably ruins the missile. So if you can't get it within that time frame, you might be a bit SOL. Okay, see, that guy's doing a lot more damage. Not that I wanted him to. Yeah, I don't see why some equipped guns will do like a lot of damage and then others will do like zero. It's a bit weird. Um, what does that do? That just. Oh, that does it from all directions. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna mess with the equipped cards there. Alright, let's try. Let's try using this spin kick thing and see what that. Is it? Oh, it does. Oh, it hits multiple people. Okay. Huh. Well, I'm gonna use it anyway. I should go and heal, because he's going to get a few turns on me because of this. Now, well, let's see. Would I be able to kill him? There's a... I have decent to hit, but I don't trust it, so I'm going to use a... <coughs> yeah, he's probably going to get quite a few turns on me before this is over. Just because of all the cost I accrued. Oh, then, oh yeah, I need to speed it up a bit. Are you running right, bitch? Oh, yeah, I forgot I had two evades from the front. See, yeah, you want to quit cards, but, you know, you just have to kind of uh, figure out the right ones to use. Okay, I definitely want to move closer to him. I might just punch him and then shoot him. That might be the way to, best way to go about this. All right, I'm going to punch you. That be, might be enough damage, too. Oh, and you fainted, so all right, let's uh, finish you off. Percentage-wise, I should have you. Yeah, there we go. That's a lot better. I guess some com some confrontations are all. It's all based. I just didn't have the heart of the cards the first time I I lost in that case. But it was just, you know, I I got there on the end of my turn. They all moved and just started shooting me. I was like, it's ridiculous. Um, anyway, I've eliminated the enemy soldiers. Forget the drawbridge. Head west on the double. If she gets away with that data, we'll back to square one. Get a hold of that phony Tylico snake. What happened to the real Tylico then? Yes, sir. Heading west. Head west. Go west, young man. Go west. Or is it north by northwest? No? Okay. Right. Yeah, let's see what the... Uh, I haven't activated her card yet, so let's see what her little thing is. If it has anything. <laughs> Yeah, when you encounter at the beginning of the game. I, I personally think the Olga, uh, Olga model is pretty hot, actually. So, um, Or really cute, at least, if anything. But anyway, let's get out of here. Why do we have to control ourselves to get out? Why can't we just leave? Where's the... Yeah, whatever. It's not like they're going to have us get ambushed again, right? Better not. I'm going to punch uh, I'll, I swear to God, I'll punch a baby if that happens again. But yeah, that missile thing was awesome. Obviously, if you use the missile... Oh, this is the one that only locks on machines, so... Really, I won't need that one until, like, much later in the game. Probably when when, uh, when we start fighting, like, tanks or some crap like that. So, alright, let's finish this mission. Go, get out of here, snake. Gotta go after Tlaiko or Swallowtail. Mission complete. dun 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 Wee, wee, wee. Oh, we got an S rank. All right, that's the. I think that's the best rank you can get. Yeah. How come I don't didn't get any other? Uh. No kills. Well, that's not possible. You have to kill them. So okay. Well, I guess they're just leaving them there as a generalization. So that's a card set from getting them from earlier. Spock's being another Olga. Weapon seven. Cool. What do we get for actually finishing it? Uh, I mean, we could always use more. More cards like that. Especially move cards. Hold on, Snake. What is it? It's Alice. She... Wait a minute. I need a little more time. There is no time. Play it. <laughs> Are you telling Solid Snake to be quiet? Pick up the pace, Alice. At this rate... Ugh. This is unbelievable. First Gary, now Tlaiko. Tell me you're not next, Snake. Roger. Sorry, it's just that I've reached my limit. 
That's odd. She should have fled north. But I've spotted her. Where? Very close. The building right in front of you. Isn't that the place you had a bad feeling about? Yes. Ebro Tower. According to intelligence, it was some sort of prototype factory. Maybe she's using it as a base of operations. Roger, who are we talking about here? It's not Talaiko. But she or... He said he was your pupil. He? What? Talaiko is a real person, and as a member of HRT, I'm sure she was on this mission. But that thing wasn't Talaiko. Then who is it? Belgear? No. Beagle related documents, Justin from headquarters. Referred to one La Clown. No, she did laugh weird a lot for some weird reason. Clown. Like Hong Kong, Bozo of the Clown? No. Nationality and gender are unknown. No one's even seen its real face. The clown is a beagle hired assassin, master of disguise and hypnotism. Why didn't she just kill Snake then or he or whatever? Beagle feared their hidden Pythagoras research data would be bought, brought to light, so LeClown was hired to steal it before the Leona unit of our team could get a hold of it. Oh, this could have been brought to my attention yesterday! Then to cover it up. Dot, dot, dot. Or dot, dot, dot. Snake, I need you to infiltrate that factory and get Pythagoras back from Clown. Yes, sir. Well, we were going to do that anyway. You didn't really have to tell me, but I guess chain of command and all that, so... All right, we're back to we're back to single character again with Snake. So Talaiko has left the party, or actual Talaiko, it's hard to say. Yeah. Yeah. I mean that spin kick actually wasn't bad. Um, buy a couple more. Just I'm trying to get more like gun cards. Ooh, equipped to use disappears after stealth, huh? What's this one? Equipped to use, enemy no longer sees user. Oh, that's awesome. D disappears up to 20 cost or when attacked. So that'd be good for like uh, uh, like if I alert situations and then I could get run to a good spot to hide. Use the optical processing to match user's appearance to surrounding in real time. Makes them visible to enemy. Huh. Oops. I was gonna buy one more set of cards. Uh, survival kit. Allies life. I never get any new cards. Oh, there's the hang ability. I knew you could hang in this game. Da 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 da! I guess I got. I guess I got a rare. Uh, okay, hang. So you can hang. You just have to have the ability, huh? Although I think there was another solid snake card that gives you hang as well. But well, who knew that to do basic functions in the game you need a card for it? Eh, I got a gun. We already have one of those. But we get solid as snake. First and last appearance is Melgar Solid Two. Uh, Solid as snake. Dual blades must be adjacent to target to use. Attack 50 times four and effective against machines. Oh, so you can, as long as you're next to a target and use it, you get, basically it's a more awesome Gray Fox, it seems like, that doesn't work on robots, unlike Gray Fox or the Ninja can work on machines or any character. Yeah. The perfect, the perfect snake, balanced in every way, neither solid nor liquid, also known as George Sears, 43rd president of the United States of America, spoilers, leads, uh, leads the armed group of Sons of Liberty, and now you should, uh, now you should die as the little Jackie boy I once knew. You know, the disappointing fact of Solidus Snake is that ends up, he ends up getting beat. I mean, spoilers, he ends up getting beaten by Raiden in, his, in the game because Raiden's the main character. It's kind of almost, like, disappointing that Snake doesn't go up against him because he went up against Liquid and other such. So, I don't know. That's probably one of the few disappointments of Metal Gear Solid 2. Oh, well. And well, with that, with that stealth added, I don't know. I'm kind of, I'm kind of uh, antsy to add that to my uh, repertoire of cards. Uh, let's look at our. Let's see what we can get rid of. I every time I have a counter card, I seem to just have bad luck with it. Maybe I should just have Snake use a uh, use a avoid or evade or armor cards and as equipped and stuff countering the other way. Because I seem to always like get unlucky and they're always at zero damage or whatever. And uh, so yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the equipped. Uh, Oh yeah, I don't have those. I don't have the equip cards now, or I don't have those card level ones now because of uh, um, uh, uh, because Trilika is not on my team anymore, so I have to equip. Although I guess I don't have to, but okay, that's an awesome card, but it, but 
I don't have 500 life. Like most of the time, I could just use a uh, a ration to get the same results. So I'm gonna remove that. Same with since I don't have it double. It only doubles allies interference. So I'm gonna get rid of her card. So I'm gonna put on the snake one again. I'm gonna put on Solidus because I like that. If I ever get up close, which I seem to be doing a lot. Oh, she, t oh, she's still considered, huh? Even though she's not on my team, she's still considered. Maybe you can still do the. Um, I bet you can still do like uh, missions, like uh, for points and stuff like that, and have her on your team. Uh, okay, I need to get rid of one more. Oh, I don't even have body. Really, I don't have body around. Um, God, with only 35, I, I, you know, sometimes you kind of just notice that uh, you just don't have enough options or whatever. Yeah, I want the. Yeah, I definitely want the evades. Sure. Spin kick. I mean, not required. Uh, but I do need. I do like having more. I don't think I need multiple action cards. I think I'll just have two at most. So that'll be a way to get another. The other card. Card level one and two. Uh, although, will I need those for regular missions? Because I seem like maybe those are only meant for. Uh, only meant for the bonus missions. Um, let's see, there's the action plus. So you could either get like one card that gives you two, or or multiple cards that give you one, but it costs so much. Uh, let's see, spin kick. I kind of want to put. Although I got quite a few evades, that might be enough, like equip cards. Let's see, I might get rid of the stinger because I don't think I like having the Nikita missile. That was kind of fun, but I might get rid of the stinger, or maybe even get rid of one of the claymores because I almost I'm hardly ever using those. Um. Uh, Let's get yeah. Let's get rid of the no, not the key. Let's get rid of the stinger and give myself some body armor just in case, because I seem to be seem to suffer from uh, getting damaged on quite a regular basis. So. Um, okay. All right. I think. Whoops. I think that'll that'll work for now. So. All right. Well, it looks like Snake's got himself another mission. The pathet well, we got well a change mission. We now got to get the pat the Pythagoras data from the clown, it seems like, who has taken the form of Talaiko. But what has happened to Lyco? And what will we be able to get into the factory to get the Pythagoras data? Find out next time in the next episode of Metal Gear Acid. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.